For me, one. And so they know each other's game very well. And it was the same with Tarek Moman. And they still can't read him at the front of the court. And it's something that I can see developing more from Gawad. I mean, the skill set that he has, that uh, was a slightly questionable pickup. But Gawad sweeping it cross court. Six one. Just so clinical, isn't he? When he gets the opportunity, picks the right shot at the moment. It's classic work from Gawad. Using the diagonal to stretch Ali Farag. It's going to be a stroke, I think. Straight away, so Gawad converts first time. 11 4, game to Gawad. been an increase in the tempo from Farag. He's looking to inject a bit of pace into proceedings here. Hit the ball a bit harder, looking to get onto the ball a bit sharper. That's an outrageous <laughs> shot. <laughs> it is. That was such a lethal shot. I thought I, I saw one, two. a possible change in face of Abdul Gawad, but I've, I'm not, I can't confirm that. Well, he kind of choice. stopped, didn't he? It was a good I choice mean, of shot. It was a great choice of shot because he had to really bend the elbow in to straighten that. That's, this and is the quality of Abdul Gawad to actually improvise the shot. Really bent the elbow in. We can't wow. do that. <laughs> you just can't wow. do that. that was, you just could not. <laughs> I mean, that, Nine, seven. that was ridiculous. It's like I mean, a bullet. It, it was. It was a poor width, <laughs> but he hit this as hard as possible. I mean, that was so dead. <laughs> this could be yes, a stroke. Oh, he's it's going to go review. to the video yeah, decision. And the yes, let decision. This is video close. review, sorry. So Gawad reviewing this one. This is uh, very close, but initially, oh, I thought that could be a stroke. No, I, I think he went for the man ever so slightly before he went for the ball. It was a loose ball, ball, though. It was a loose ball from uh, Ali Farag, and he it stayed is, over the shot. He's still there, isn't he? That's the problem. He stayed over the shot. See, initially, he definitely goes towards the man yeah, more than wanting to go to the ball, but he's still there. So I think this is going to be a stroke, you know. I think this is a stroke as well, because Ali Farag plays a bad shot, and he doesn't clear. He's not clearing that. I think this is going to be a stroke. One thing, if you do pay, play a poor shot, you've got to get, front, out, way, got to get out of the way. And that's another fantastic Go overall. The you video referee rules. is on fire here in Cairo. Well, that's a great shot. That's the way to straighten the ball up in the front right. Well, Ali Farag distracted himself there because he was so involved with the pickup previously that uh, and the assassin is pushing ruthlessly on 6 1 Oh no. I can't believe it. His leg's gone. I don't believe this. Is he holding his calf or his hamstring there? His though? hamstring's gone. I can't believe that this has happened. It looks like he's holding his Achilles. Yeah. I can't believe it. I honestly can't believe this. Well, if that's his it's Achilles gone, then that's a, that's a shocker. Are you ready to continue He's moving now? a lot freer than I thought he would be by the way he actually went down there. OK, good. Well, well, if anyone possesses the skills to be able to pick someone off without moving too much, it's Kareem Abdul-Gawad. I thought you were just about to say to 
to, to heal within four seconds. <laughs> it's That's right. Baby faced assassin. Well, that's a nice shot from Gawad. Good response from the baby faced assassin. And down. Perfect Nine balance five. in there. We saw a bit of passion as well. Head nod and a fist bump. I don't know how he got that. All that. <laughs> no one. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, I'm sure he's not getting, staying in this rally now. Oh, he's going to get a stroke. He's going to get a stroke. He will get a stroke. He's, he's wiggled the finger stroke. for a he's video de review. But he's definitely uh, and it is a stroke. <laughs> so with that confirmation, <laughs> Kareem abdul Gawad puts his hands on his head. He congratulates his opponent, Ali Farag. It's the biggest event the babyface assassin has ever won on the PSA World Tour. And how fitting is it to be one in Cairo, but also in this fantastic setting right by the pyramids. Thoroughly deserved victory for this highly skilled and very cool customer, Kareem Abdul Gawad. Well, Drew Boy, he was uh, on it from the word go, really, Kareem Abdul Gawad. And, uh, the better player throughout the whole of that final. Yeah, it was a great performance from Kareem Abdul Gawad. So just 40 minutes, Kareem Abdul Gawad converts Ali Farag uh, in three games. Three games to love. 11-4, 11-7, 11-5. And now, ladies and gentlemen, can I ask our most honoured guest, the Minister of Youth and Sport, to make the presentation to Kareem as the 2016 Al-Aram New Giza Squash Open Champion.